Hello and welcome to this full version of World Space Trees. Now in this pack you'll get a few more trees than you do in the light pack. So I've been working on a few variations of a cherry blossom. So there's four quadrants to that that get mixed up when you move the tree around. You can see that it swaps different types. You can double the trees together to make them thicker. So I've taken one and make it, made it a little bit smaller. Be sure to make their pivot um, first and then you can rotate and you've got both of them there and it makes it a bit thicker. Uh, I've done the same with some of these pine trees and you've also got the, the 12 base trees that uh, base textures that come with it. Now I've added some post process in this and I've also added a directional light that rotates so if you look at this light rotator, it's got a speed here of minus 20. So when I play this, you'll see kind of day and night cycle. And I've also got post process on the on the camera here. So I've got anti-lacing, ambient occlusion, I've got some motion blur, just a little bit, not not too much. And I've got a little bit of colour grading. Don't need, don't need any bloom. Anything like that, just motion blur, a little bit of colour grading. And really I just I just amp up the the exposure and the contrast. That's the only two things I really bother with there. Chromatic aberration just gives that kind of wild edge. So I just like that just a little bit. And vignette, you can see, gives that kind of an extra eye. I do like using like dark blues for some reason. And it looks quite nice. Now, <clears throat> in the ground, I've added just back there. In the ground, I've added a new shader that mixes this um, this grass texture between two tones. So it's called Tiling Mixer One, and this will come with it. So you can mix like two different values there, make them slightly different. Let me just stop the game for a second so we can see that, and you can change the tiling amount of one against the other and also the noise offset and any noise tiling so that's a bit stark at the minute what we'll do is I'll just copy the same colour as this and then you can maybe just tone it down just a little bit and it just helps break things up a bit Noise tiling's a bit high. Okay, and you also have metalness and smoothness. If you need those, and emissiveness, if you need that. Okay, so I'll be working on a few extra things in the next few days. I'll be looking to add more leaves, plus a little bit of... Um, leaf deposit I guess or petals deposited on the ground just underneath a uh, little particle effect of the leaves falling same with these ones and the pine trees the pine trees I'm going to do a bit of work on those because these ones they look a bit uh, a bit ragged I guess um, a little bit like broken pine trees but I like the the cherry blossoms turned out quite nice and these ones are still quite good so I'll be working on a few variations of these, especially those ones. And that's pretty much that. Okay, so there's a free pack where you get just these and you don't get the extra shaders or anything. Uh, the full paid one you'll get, <coughs> excuse me, you'll get these trees, these trees, the mixer for the ground and a whole lot of other things. Uh, plus you get a couple of different shader types so there's a cutout and dugger shader they do slightly different things so this is the cutout shader 
but the post process stack helps helps make it work. So if you see if I toggle the post process the difference. So you see it helps thicken up all the leaves and gives you that nice ambient occlusion and things. So that's pretty much what you'll get in this pack. Uh, it's going to be $7 to start with. The more things I add may increase the price, so get it early and you'll get the updates free. Uh, excuse me for the, the throat, I've just got a little bit of a cold, but I wanted to get this demo, uh, this pack up as soon as possible. So thanks very much for watching. Bye now.